In this video, let's look at uh, inserting a page break in between groups. So here we have some normal sales order data. We have the sales order number, order quantity, unit price, unit price discount, line total. But you see they're all on one page. There's no breaks in between. So what I'm going to do is come over here and go into our section expert click on the group footer and then go to paging. Here we want to click on new page after and say OK. And there you have it. We have each sales order is on its own page. And so then you can actually you can actually put the page headers down below the sales number, sales order number, because that this sales order number is going to be on each page. So, so then we can make it look a little better here. There we go. And then. The other thing I wanted to mention is that on the last page you're going to get a blank because it's basically it's going to take it very literally and insert a page after each group. So then on the last sales order it's going to insert a page. So let me show you how to fix that. See here's our blank page we have after the and to get rid of that let's go back into our section expert. Click on paging and our group footer, new page after, and then we're actually going to write not on last record. Actually, this is all one word, I believe. On last record. Save and close. OK. Preview. Let's see. It's just rendering everything here. And there you go, got rid of our, our blank page. And there you have it. Thank you.